This summer, the nature restoration law made headlines all over Europe as we watched the European Parliament support the law in what became a very tight and insanely politicized vote. And it is adopted. Europeans collectively sighed in relief thinking that the nature restoration law passed and that we stand a fighting chance against the climate crisis. But that's not what actually happened. Sorry to be the bearer of bad news, but the fight to get the nature restoration law isn't over, and it's still at risk of never seeing the light of day. What happened in July is that we got the EU Parliament's version of the law. That allowed the negotiations to continue. The EU Parliament, Commission, and Council each have their own position on the law, and right now they're discussing the final version. This is what the EU calls the Trilogue Negotiations, and it's a crucial stage in the EU lawmaking process. Right now, the final content of the law is being decided. Right now, the future of our peatlands, grasslands, forests, rivers and seas are being decided. Right now, our future and our resilience against the climate crisis is being decided. So we need this law to be as strong and impactful as possible. Wait, I'm confused. I thought we had a nature restoration law already. Is that not true? We don't have it yet, but we're getting close. It's important we continue to support a nature restoration law with teeth, one that will fight the nature and climate crisis. So keep reaching out to your national environment ministers and to your members of the European Parliament. The fight isn't over yet. And keep watching this space. We need you.